Hey Coach Darrow, Liv Maurer here. Um, making this video has allowed me to really reflect on the past couple years of my life, um, and especially the, the four years that I spent at Notre Dame running track and cross country with you. And um, it's made me realize how much I really miss it and how f those four years are some of the best of my life. And I have all, I have just you to thank for that. And, um, you know, I, I've played so many sports in my life. I played basketball. I did volleyball for a little bit. Um, I played lacrosse for 10 plus years. Um, I did gymnastics for a really long time growing up and I've done track and cross country and I have to say hands down out of all of those years and all of those sports you 100% have been the best coach I've ever had in my entire life and you have uh, have created me into the person that I am today because of that and I just really have to thank you um however um I definitely did not start out loving cross country um I share this story a lot but in fourth grade um, I think it was the summer of going into my fifth grade year. Um, I did the cross country camp that your son, Jack Darrow and Ryan Dory ran and I hated it. I remember, um, John and, um, Aaron and Kyle, we'd wait for them to go ahead of Quinn and I, and then we'd run behind them and then we'd cut a street off and then hide in the bushes and then wait till they ran past and they came back out and we'd start running again. But then... I remember one of the like the last weeks they caught us and they saw us in the bushes and they made us like sprint across like all the way to the school like prospect school and back or not prospect to CHMS and back and I just remember being like oh my god I'm never doing that again like whatever and I was like oh I don't want to do cross country like I don't like this whatever and then all of a sudden I started cross country with you and I absolutely loved it um I was going between you know, being at cross country for like five minutes and then going to lacrosse practice, but I made it work and I have you to thank for that. And I also have so many memories of going down to state with you. Um, definitely fifth grade year was the best um, with Cece Bafardi, um, Aaron Howard and Emma Shannon and driving down to state and leaving at like 5 a.m. and sleeping in the car with my eyes open and changing the screensaver on your phone and your car warning you with a coffee cup sign that you were driving slow or something like that. I don't remember exactly what it was, but um, I just have so many great memories in Notre Dame and I have you to thank for that and I could not be more appreciative. So happy 15 years, Coach Darrow, and we love you. Hey, Coach Darrow, congratulations on the occasion of your 15-year cross-country coaching anniversary at Notre Dame School. Your contributions are many, not only as Notre Dame's coach, but as an active leader of the Suburban Parochial League, a member of the IESA's Cross Country Advisory Committee, the Illinois Track and Cross Country Coaches Association, where you were named a Coach of the Year by your peers, and as the founder and head coach of the West Suburban Harriers. We are truly fortunate to have such a passionate advocate and thank you for all you have done for our sport. We look forward to many more years to come and wish you continued success. Hey Coach Darrow, it's John. I just wanted to congratulate you on 15 years of coaching. I really, I really appreciate all that you've done for the sport of cross country and track and, uh, and for our school especially. I remember specifically when I came in during sixth grade, I was never really like I would never really thought I would be the best at running was never really for it and you ended up teaching me that if I was able to just dedicate myself put my mind to it that I could achieve things that I didn't think were possible and that led me to end up being able to join the state team eighth grade year and getting third in state and it also uh, after I kept progressing I was able to become one of the top runners at NAS and I don't think I could have done any any of it without you. Hi, Dad. It's Caroline here, reporting live from Lucky's room. Lucky, do you want to say hi? Well. <laughs> Anyways, I just wanted to come on here to just tell you how proud I am of you. I just have never seen someone be not only a role model to their own children, but to a community of children who have now grown up to be adults, but yet still see you as such a big role model in their lives. 
this impact you have had on so many children and families is the most admirable thing I could ever witness. You have been just the most incredible father to watch over the last 20 years. You've made me a better person in every possible way and you could not make me prouder. I love just watching how much work you put in after hours for this team. You have taught me what it means to put your whole heart into something and how by doing that, you can make the greatest impact possible. And that's the best lesson I've ever learned in my life. And I wish I could be there to hug you right now, but just know how much I love you and how I could not be prouder to be your daughter. Hey, Coach Darrow. Hey, Coach Darrow. Hey, Coach Darrow. Congratulations, congrats on 15, 15 years. years. Hey, Coach Darrow. Uh, congrats on 15 years of coaching. I just want to say a quick thank you for everything you've done for me uh, and the rest of the team and everyone who's... Hi, Coach Darrow. Thank you so much for everything you've done for us over all these years. Hey, Coach Darrow. Congrats on 15 years in Notre Dame. I'm really proud to have been coached by you. And uh, I'm, I know... Everyone else is too. Uh, congrats again. Uh, yeah, all the best. Hi, Coach Darrow. It's great. Congrats on 15 years. Thanks for all the support. Hey, Coach Darrow. Congrats on 15 years of coaching. Some of my favorite memories were when you would be yelling at us right before we turned for the final straightaway at State. And I'd say some of my not so favorite are when you make us do the 400 workouts on speed days. Thanks for all that you do for the running community and thanks for the memories. Hey Coach Darrow, congratulations on 15 years. I'm glad to be able to be a part of your program and thank you for helping me fall in love with running. Wish you the best. Hey Coach Darrow, I want to congratulate you on 15 years of coaching. Thank you for being a great coach. You've helped me and many other runners mature and become not only great runners, but great people. So thanks for all you do and congratulations. Hi, Coach Darrow. Congratulations on 15 years as head coach of Notre Dame Cross Country. Thank you for showing us all how to be team players and what true dedication looks like. I cannot thank you enough for all you have done for me at Notre Dame. Congratulations. Hi, Coach Darrow. Happy 15th year of coaching. Um, thank you for all you have taught me. Um, Notre Dame is so lucky to have you, and uh, thank you. Go North Stars. Thank you, Coach Darrow. You've done so much for all of us runners. You're so kind and care very much. We appreciate all the time and effort you've put into coaching. Congratulations. Hey, Coach Darrow. Just wanted to congratulate you on uh, 15 years of coaching at Notre Dame. I just want to thank you for all you did for me, even though um, I was only there at Notre Dame for a short period of time. Um, you really helped me with my running career and um, just becoming the person I am today. So thank you. Hi, Coach Darrow. It's Beth Sherwick. Thank you for everything you taught me, and congratulations on 15 years. Hi, Coach Darrow. Congrats on coaching for 15 years at Notre Dame. Um, I'm so grateful for your guidance that I received while helping out with West Suburban Harriers. Hi, John. Um, I understand it's been 15 years that you've been coaching, and so I just wanted to say a little something for you, and I um, found something out of the Gospel of Mark, and it reads, Whoever receives one child such as this in my name receives me, and whoever receives me receives not me, but the one who sent me. And so I just wanted to say thank you, because for 15 years you have welcomed one child at a time, starting with your own son, Jack, and um, you made every child feel like they were the most important child you were going to coach and that there was nothing that they couldn't do. You saw in every child a success story. So I just want to thank you for coaching. I thank you for co-coaching because you even taught me things. You were always prepared. Uh, you, you saw the sky was the limit. Um, you brought a state win championship to our school, to our parish, and to the town of Clarendon Hills um, more than once. And you are rocking it. Thanks for 15 years. We hey, Coach Sarah, congrats on 15 years 
of coaching. I have to say, if it wasn't for your coaching me in middle school, I would definitely not be at the level of running that I am right now. And uh, I never really appreciated what you did back in middle school until I did Harriers and had to realize what you uh, what you had to deal with on a daily basis. <laughs> and I have to say, it was a lot more than I thought it was. And uh, I definitely respect you for it. But uh, one one memory that uh, comes to mind when I think of you is uh, back in uh, my eighth grade year when I was doing Chicago Flyers and I asked if you could film something for me uh, for student council. <laughs> and uh, you ended up saying something, like, filming something like, um, uh, like you shouldn't do drugs. Drugs are bad. And you should never do them. Stuff like that. It was for uh, some uh, anti-drug thing we were doing at school. <laughs> and one of the other coaches came up to us, like, Quinn, are you doing drugs? <laughs> I have to say that is one of my favorite memories that I have with you, and uh, definitely like you pushing me when I when I never thought I would like be anything in cross country. <clears throat> And uh, you believed in me when no one else could. And I have to say, I thank you so much for it. Congratulations, Coach Darrow. Hi, Coach Darrow. Congrats on 15 years of coaching. It was such an honor to be coached by you, and I wouldn't be the person or athlete I am today without you. Some of my best memories come from running track and cross country at Notre Dame, and I learned so many lessons throughout those seasons as well. I was able to develop leadership skills, endurance, and mental toughness that I still hold with me to this day. I'm also so grateful I was able to be a part of history as the first girls team to make it to state, and it's been so cool to watch the growth of the program since then. I also love the opportunity to coach Harriers and admire all you do in the community to help grow the sport. Congrats on this awesome accomplishment, and I appreciate everything you've done for me. Coach Darrow, congratulations on 15 years. Uh, Notre Dame would not be what it is today without your input and without your gifts. Um, to name a few of the gifts that you've given our community. First and foremost, a winning program, right? Two state championships while I was there um, and hundreds upon hundreds of medals and ribbons and trophies since I've left. So thank you for uh, that opportunity. On top of a winning program, um, you have taught us so much about competitive nature, humility, and work ethic. Um, you have molded the minds of hundreds of young athletes um, and shaped hundreds of people that will go forth from the Notre Dame community uh, to do great things. And um, I would like to thank you for being a part of my life and, um, and, and, and hundreds of uh, others that have gone through your program. On top of those things, probably the greatest thing you gave our community, three phenomenal athletes Jack Darrow, Jimmy Darrow, and Caroline Darrow, three of my friends um, and three people that are phenomenal competitors and phenomenal people. So thank you so much for everything you've given us um, and everything you've done for our community. I hope you continue uh, to shape young athletes um, from time to come. So thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank you so much, Coach Shero. You made me look forward to going to practice every day, and you're so supportive even now after I've graduated from Notre Dame. You've made me love the sport, and thank you so much. Hi, Coach Shero. Happy 15 years. Thank you so much for what you've done for me and for the community. Without you, I want to be the passionate runner I am today. Once again, congrats on the 15-year milestone, and I hope you have a great day. Coach Cheryl, thank you so much for being a great coach. We've learned so much from you. Thank you for all you've done. Hey, Coach Darrow. This is Max Gnomes. I wanted to congratulate you on 15 years of coaching. You've helped me so much through my athletic career, and I wanted to wish you the best. Congrats on 15 years, Coach. Thank you for everything you did for me. Hey, Coach Darrow. This is Aiden Gnomes. I just wanted to say thank you for helping me progress along my athletic career and I wanted to congratulate you on 15 years of coaching cross country. Happy 15 years of coaching! Thank you for giving us an awesome foundation. And thanks for making me a better runner. And don't worry, coach, we won't do stupid. Hey, Coach Darrell, uh, congrats on 15 years of coaching at Notre Dame. You know, you've truly made such a difference in the lives of so many young men and women at Notre Dame. Um, I can say that you've truly shaped me into the man I am today. Um, and I'm forever grateful for the opportunity I had to run under you and learn from you. So congrats again, coach. 
Hey, Coach Darrow, it's Zach Gooding. Uh, first and foremost, just wanted to congratulate you on 15 years of coaching um, and how much, and just let you know how much it meant to me uh, to have you as a coach for four years during my time at Notre Dame. Not sure if you can remember, but when I first started with you in the fifth grade, I couldn't even make it a mile without stopping to take a break. And uh, by the end of my eighth grade year, to be a part of that team that took home the state championship is something I've always carried with me. Uh, something that I've learned from you um, during my time at Notre Dame that I've really carried with me um, since is just being able to uh, put your head down and keep going and really learn to be comfortable with being uncomfortable. That's not only something I applied to uh, high school athletics and collegiate athletics, but that's something that I've applied um, in my everyday life. And I really can't thank you enough for that. And also wanted to thank you for the individual attention that you give every athlete that comes into the program. I'm truly a one of a kind person. Um, so once again, congratulations on 15 years of coaching. Hey, Coach Darrow, I want to congratulate you on 15 years of coaching. It's a great feat and awesome for me to be a part of that, be a runner under you for four years at Notre Dame. And I can't explain to you how you've changed my life and all of my classmates and everyone I know who ran under you. Everyone has good things to say about you. Really helped everyone to get to, get to where we are today. So just want to say thank you for all that and congratulations. Hey, Coach Darrow, Bradley Domke here. I want to say congrats on 15 years and everything you've done for me and for the Notre Dame program. It wouldn't be as special as it is without you. Hey, Coach Darrow, it's Nolan. I just wanted to say congratulations on 15 years. I can say that undoubtedly you have taught me, Donovan, Elizabeth, and Emma how to be disciplined in just about everything that we do. And I really thank you for that. So please keep up the good work and I hope to see you soon. Hi, Dad. Congrats on your milestone. Thank you for thank you for introducing me to cross country in the first place. I remember running running on running on the treadmill in, for one mile at once every week in fourth grade. I, I would want to stop and stand on the side of the treadmill, but you but you would make sure I would not do that and and finish my run. Thank you for also pushing me to get even faster in, in eighth grade, even 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 as everyone was was growing and I was and and I was staying my same height. I think I, I think I got my sense of determination from that time in my running career, and that I would not uh, allow height to discourage me from getting faster. I also know that sense of determination ha helped me in my battle with lupus my freshman year of high school at Fenwick, and I still use that sense of determination in, in, in everything I do to this day. Winning state in 2012 and 2014 it's still one of my favorite moments in my life. I know it is yours too. Congrats again on your on your milestone. I know you. I know you still have many years of coaching left. Thank you, Dad. You are truly the goat dad and coach, and always go Iris. Hey, Coach Darrow, it's Donovan here. I just wanted to say congratulations on a tremendous fifteen years of coaching cross country and track in Notre Dame. I know that me personally, I didn't take the normal path into the running world. Uh, my fifth and sixth grade years, I didn't come out for cross country or track because I was, I was just a swimmer at the time. You know, I didn't think that I would have had the endurance or athletic ability on land to make it work for myself. But um, I'll never forget the, uh, the day at the beginning of my seventh grade year when my mom dragged me along to pick up Nolan from cross country practice and you let me hop in at the end of practice to close things out for the day and then uh, sat me down afterwards and talked about me and made, like asked me to consider joining cross country. And I'll forever be grateful for you for taking time out of your day to sit me down with like families were already driving away. You could have just easily gone home, but no, you decided to sit me down and say, Hey, like, I think, you could really enjoy this. You could have a lot of fun with this. And I did, I, I really did. I, I, I had such a, a fun time and just a blast in general while running for you. I, I know I was a little bit of a project for you, was not the most coordinated kid and was not, not the fastest, but I just want to say thank you for being patient with me and like allowing me to kind of ease into the sport <laughs> if, if that's fair to say but um i also wanted to thank you for just welcoming me welcoming me into the team i really felt like i had been there the, uh, the previous two years it felt like i'd been there for the whole ride 
Um, and me, me and my siblings will still every now and then talk about how fun practices used to be for both cross country and track. Uh, you, you just do such a great job at bringing teams close together to get that family feel and that close knit environment, which is so important for sports that often gets overlooked. Um, another cool tradition that I stole from you for my swimming career is that, uh, before every, every single swim race, from the time that I graduated Notre Dame for, through high school, through college, and through international meets, every single swim race that I competed in, I prayed a little Hail Mary, Hail Mary beforehand. And uh, there were a couple times where when I was praying to Hail Mary, I, I would see myself in the circle, like standing on grass with a bunch of guys in gold jerseys around me with you standing right next to me. And I really think that's because those, those are my favorite memories in athletics growing up. That's, that, that was my happy place. So um, I just wanted to say thank you. You're, you're a great coach. You're a fantastic human being. Just keep it up. I, I'm so excited to see the, the, the success that's still to come. And uh, keep, keep creating happy places for people. I, I, I really appreciate it. All right. I love you, Coach Darrow. Hey, Coach. Patrick here. Putting together this video, did a lot of reflecting, um, and wanted to say that uh, fifth to eighth grade cross country and track, and really just, just growing up with Jack and the Notre Dame days and all the running, biking, and swimming um, that we were involved with you for um, our – you know, that's a time in my life that I'll never forget. Um, the, the Notre Dame cross country days are still the most fun team and sports experience I have ever had and will have. Um, you and Coach Avoy, too, um, are the two best coaches that I've ever had for anything in my whole life. Um, and wa wanted to really say thank you for, you know, everything that you taught me around uh, through cross country with hard work taking pride in your work, preparation, um, being a good sport, always treating everyone with respect. I remember on that third point, uh, you know, you would always tell me how you were so proud of me for, you know, how, what a good sport and how polite I was to, to, uh, my competitors. And I was always like, well, <laughs> that's what, you know, I learned that from you. So I can thank you for it. Um, and also too, um, after getting diagnosed with, uh, type one diabetes in seventh grade, um, you know, I think those, the seventh and eighth grade, both cross country and track years, um, really helped me show, and the, the success that we had led by you really helped me show that, um, that disease does not, and like did not define me. Um, so, you know, and the, the state championship that we won in eighth grade is still, um, you know, one of the greatest accomplishments in my life and will remain so for my entire life. So wanted to just say, say thank you for the, the huge impact that you've had on my life, um, as well as my brother's life. Um, you know, whenever I'm with my family, uh, it always comes up and we, we, we talk about the old, the Notre Dame cross country and track days. So something that I'll never forget. And, um, you know, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Hey, Coach Darrell, William here. Just want to congratulate you on a tremendous 15 years of being the Notre Dame cross country coach. It's been a great, great journey, a very successful one, a lot of wins and a lot of great memories to look back on. Thinking of my time running for you alongside Pat and Jack and Jimmy, Chris Brady, Michael Moran, Bradley Domke, Joey Schultz, Donovan Lehman, I can really go on and on. Um, those really truly are, to this day, some of my greatest memories. Um, going back to my childhood, I can't think of you know a better time, especially in sports that I had with a team and with a coach like you. You taught us every single day, discipline, preparation, um, how to come together as a team, how to be a good sport. And all that really helped all of us, uh, especially myself, uh, grow into the person that I am today. Um, the the things you taught us on the course, uh, I took that with me as I evolved 
in my sports career, uh, inevitably giving up running and playing basketball, I never forgot um, the things that you taught me. And uh, those lessons really helped me in a tremendous way get to where I got to in sports and to where I'm at now in life. Um, I still remember going back to the Notre Dame track meets at the university. I was actually just uh, just there a couple of weeks ago for the Ohio State game and walking by by the Mayo facility, you know, just brought back some of the greatest memories. I still remember leaving the track meets at night and heading back to the Chicagoland area and you'd drive around one of the circles, uh, the circle intersection and you'd have <laughs> you'd have Jimmy in the back seat just cracking up. Um, so all those memories, you know, as I'm reflecting and making this video uh, are coming to my mind and really putting a big smile on my face. Um, and that's that's all because of you, the way you led us, the way, um, you know, you designed practices. It was a blast. And at the same time, we used to kick ass. It was a great time. We, we won a lot of meets and, and we're very successful, a lot of great memories. I still remember those state meets, two rings and and also an individual win myself. Uh, couldn't have done it without you, coach. So I just want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. I love you and uh, keep going, keep doing it. Some of my favorite memories growing up involve running for you, dad. I remember the state of the program in 2010 when you took over. It was a tiny team. There was no work ethic or dedication, but by 2012, that team had won state and had transformed into a completely new program. I'm so proud of being a part of that with you, and I'll never forget it. Since then, I've come and gone as so many other athletes have, but this program has continued to be successful. The one constant in that time is you, Dad. I know the time you spend on nights and weekends sacrificing your free time to ensure that this program has everything that it needs. You've demonstrated a complete dedication to this team long after your kids graduated the school. I'm so proud of you for that. But the improvement in the program is only a small part of the difference you've made. You've transformed and impacted the lives of so many young people. You've allowed young athletes to grow not just as runners, but as young Catholic men and women of faith and integrity. I'm so proud of all you've accomplished, Dad. I love you and keep up the good work.